Uh, yeah. There you go. That's that's it. That it just happened. There you go. I never got the buzzing noise on that one. I don't know when the cutoff was for all of you guys. But yeah, the mouse cursor locked up. Um, I'm telling you, it's one of these. It might be shaders. It's something GPU oriented. We're going back down, everybody. <laughs> We're going back down. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't know. The page file change definitely has helped, though. It has helped. And look, we get good frames and stuff. It just it just explodes. There's something wrong. I don't know what it is. The cutoff was when you said replace that tin can. Really? Oh, that's funny. Yeah, I was mousing around like five seconds after that and the, the cursor locked up and that was it. Yeah, I don't know. And I always get like a little click noise as I know that the PSU has swapped itself off. Saved me. Cutoff was replaced that tin can. Yeah, I don't know, man. I really don't. Anyway, there you go. We that we did get through all the reads. So let's uh, let's do the achievement now, shall we? Let's do heating up the delves. I have another weird thing. Here's one of the weirdest things about this, and this is going to aggravate the shit out of me now. When I restart, now you you guys are going to think I don't know. This might be related. Um, my mouse cursor. The sensitivity breaks after some time. This isn't always, but very often after a crash, right? The sensitivity breaks and the way it breaks is left to right movement is really slow. Like I'm moving right across the mouse pad to do this right now. That's really slow and really careful there, right? Very long movements and it's hyper sensitive up and down. Like there I'm barely moving the mouse and it's already going like I'm barely moving it. So it's just that like here if i do a circular movement that's a circular movement on my mouse pad that so you can imagine how aggravating and annoying it is to play the game and stuff and it's such a subtle weird thing it, it like it took me a long time to realize what exactly the hell was going on with it um but that is the problem so if you ever watch any of my footage and the camera's going up and down like this that's because the slightest little movement is rocketing it up and down but i have to like properly move the thing across the whole pad to swing left and right so um so yeah i don't know and i feel like this is somehow connected but i don't i can't diagnose this i can't die i can't i cannot for the life of me figure out what you would google i mean i've re i'm on the logitech g600 i've reinstalled the mouse stuff three times and i've reset all the preferences and stuff three times it was like a thing I tried and then I despaired and went to something else. And then a thing I tried and I despaired and I went to something else. And the only way to fix this is I have to reboot again. I have to double reboot. No, no, no. But the mouse is fine if it's not in a... If, 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 if it doesn't crash, the mouse is fine. It's all It all works. Everything works. It's just after the crash. Which one am I missing? Sorry, we're missing the middle guy, the champion ice beast. It, that, this sucks because this is a beautiful instance. This is a really pretty instance. To be honest, guys, I recorded yesterday um, some footage on this rev for an End of Dragons daily. I actually have too much footage at the moment. I'm doing all this stuff and there's like not enough commentary for all the footage I'm recording, right? So I'm saving some of it. And I, I recorded some footage and I actually made the decision. I recorded some footage at the highest graphics I could and I got the whole way through the video without it crashing. I got the whole way through. So I was feeling really confident that it was I was fixing it, which is why today I'm even pushing this up. But I chose not to put that in today's End of Dragons daily. You're not going to see that footage in the background. I cut it out and I swapped it because I thought it looked a little bit tacky to do a PC drive where in the commentary I'm talking about a PC drive and and people would watch the video and be like, "Well, that's ultra settings. It looks fine." So I thought, don't don't do the ultra one today. I know you've got it. Just do it tomorrow because it's gonna look a bit bit weird. So um, so I really did think I was getting out of the woods. I'm very very disappointed from that crash. I'm much more I'm much more frustrated on the inside than I'm showing right now. Ah. Redeem. Highlight my message. 4K. You mean 4K? Oh, you want the new PC to to do 4K videos? See, I don't know. It, it depends what the rendering time's like. But when you go to 4K, you start dealing with upload time issues. And I've noticed it really affects my enjoyment of the game if I'm taking ages and ages to upload. 
by the game I mean the 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 experience of uh, uh, where's my overlay stuff? Oh, there you go. I mean, being a, being a YouTuber, that game. Oh, let's talk about the YouTube community poll thing as well for a second. Um, I did a YouTube community poll yesterday. First time I've ever done it. And wow, the feature is used. Super, wait, what? Holy shit. Omega Flames, you gotta stop, man. He really is a money bags. He really is a dude. What is that? Omega Flame says, "Let's get that 4K." Oh, you're not talking about resolution. You're talking about pounds. <laughs> uh, holy shit! Let's get that 4K, and you really do need to replace that cam now. Omega Flame says, "Dude," and then rounding afterwards, just rounding the number on the bar. Wait, are we at 4,000? Oh, we're at 4,004. That's unbelievable. That's a palindrome number right there. Thank you so much. That's how the fuck are we? A thousand five hundred pounds over the goal. Over the goal. Maybe I should edit today's video. I, I don't think I should advertise this anymore. Four thousand and four computer not found. Uh, you guys are way too generous. You are watching the stream, right? You do know that I don't even know what that would buy. We need a new bar. This one's full. I'm not doing that. I'm not. I, I refuse to do another bar with like a fucking stretch goal. Oh, we got to 4K. Oh, wow. That's the achievement done. We got to 4K, so, uh, you know, let's go to 5. And then and then people are ludicrously generous and you go to 5. And so you're greedy again. Oh, let's let's go to 6, you know. And you just keep doing it until eventually it stops and everyone's just looking at you like some greedy arsehole. Like, why the fuck are you still pushing this? Like, talk about abusing goodwill. I'm not doing another bar. I'm not doing another bar. New chair funders next. No, you guys don't even really benefit from that. I'm happy with my chair. I don't have back issues. I'm fine. Uh, I've got that weird thing now where my skin feels weird because I feel like fragile or vulnerable right now. I'm just waiting for it to crash again. We, we did properly drop it all down, right? It's funny because this is what I'm talking about. This is what's properly getting to me uh, that I mentioned in the YouTube video. <clears throat> um, It's the stress. The actual reality of just kicking up some new footage isn't too bad often especially in guild wars you know there's pretty good checkpoints and stuff around it's not too bad but it's the, the that just constant like ang anxiety wow that it's about to crash that is like it's so brutal and it was there it literally did kill the daggerfall series and it killed the ff12 series through december it really did You gotta head out now, Harry GW. Not Guild Wars, just GW. Thanks, man. Uh, and it was good to see you. Really appreciate it. You need to get his name on the call or a GPU. Well, yeah, I, that website I was talking about, they have a service where if you do, not that, if you make this Twitch stream build your PC, um, they do a thing where if you spend $150. Now, it seems like a lot of money to me. But if you spend $150, um, you can get a custom design etched into the glass or something. And you can put your, you can put like the donator's name on there in theory or whatever. Which is kind of cool. If I was like a real YouTuber and I was doing a lot of camera stuff, you might, you might, um, you might get some value out of that. But I mean, I don't really plan on, I feel like that's, that's, that's a bit, that's a bit silly to me, honestly. Elder Scrolls games and crashing. Name a better duo. Uh, yeah, I, I, to be honest, I wish I had something else on the tip of my tongue that it was like, um, yeah, no, this crashes more. <laughs> I have to say, Game Bryo, <laughs> that fucking franchise. If I was a real YouTuber man who does YouTube for a living. Okay, if I was a more standard YouTuber. I'd argue a chair is the most important part of a PC setup. You can replace a PC, but not really a body. But there's another thing going on in my mind at the moment. The place I'm currently renting, I kind of want to be out of by the end of the year. I don't know whether... Um, I don't know whether I want to be here by the end of the year. I think I'm paying too much rent, and uh, it's a bit scary. So if I can scale down, that would be better. And I like the idea of getting a new place, 
where like I've got a room that I could like just start fresh from, like get a nice new desk, like properly set things up. So all this stuff about like 7.1 surround and stuff like that, I'd love to properly like set up a room, not just have a crappy like desk in the corner or something. And at that point you could get a new chair, you know, you could do, I would like to do it, but I'd like to do it in tandem with the whole like fresh start kind of thing. Do you know what I mean? Uh, I wouldn't want to buy a bunch of new interesting stuff and then and lug it around and move all the gear later in the year if I end up moving. Which are pro is probably in my best interest to do so. Um, Kalida, Kalida, what are you doing? And Stefan, what are you doing? What is this? This is full on whale territory, man. You guys are whales. That is what I'm like Papa Gem Store, profiting off of the, the minority. This is nuts. You guys really. Uh, Kalida says chair fund for £15. Stefan, £10. I swear I heard something about 5k. Look, I'm not, I'm not going to encourage that. You're talking about another £950. Alright, we're not even close. Just be happy that we got to four. I, I know I am. So we moved from new PC to new house now. I mean, yeah, you can go <laughs> buy me a house. But it would be a lot less stress in my life if I, if I had one of those. <laughs> I'll just do a house fund. This is becoming one expensive whiskey stream. Look, the whiskey stream was good because it's so ridiculous that someone without a face cam do something like that but it's also like ironically good because it's 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 a it's a tasting stream, right? it's just like it doesn't matter whether you can see me or not you can't taste it with me the whole thing is like a joke so you know you just pull back that next layer like I, I i liked the art of that all right call me a pretentious snob or whatever but i liked the artist i liked how absurd that concept was which reveals how absurd it all is that was what I really enjoyed about the whiskey stream. But, you know, we kind of did it now. So, I, I, it's sort of a one and done almost. Oh, bye-bye. I love this instance, man, with the elevators and stuff. You know, I always credit Season 4 with its usage of elevators and stuff. And I never credit the Ice Cream Saga. I feel like a dick. They, they're doing good stuff still. Spud Club Clubhouse. Can you imagine a twit? Actually, I don't know what I'm talking about. I was going to say, can you imagine a Twitch-funded house and it's just like like a shipping container? <laughs> like, you know, you can convert a shipping container into like a cafe or whatever. And that, that's what they've been able to muster up. <laughs> but then I remember, I'll oh, know, people do do that and they get like fucking multi-million dollar condos in LA or whatever. Have you ever noticed that one of your party members straight up gets their nameplate and turned off to turned to Ryland? This blew my mind. Yeah, I did actually, yeah. I don't know if I ever talked about it when the patch came out. Another good example there of um, uh, cool engine stuff that they're doing and cool coding stuff. It's very, very awesome. I think this patch was really good. I don't know why this patch got, got shot on as much as it did. Well, I, I know why, because it didn't really have the... Well, no, this added the Misty Cape and stuff. I don't know, I don't know. This patch definitely did not get enough kudos. Maybe from yours truly. But I really... This place as well, you can't see it with these graphics, but this place is beautiful. It, it is truly gorgeous. I should try and shoot some footage of this. MTG ch I know, says chat under he, not she. Yeah, just to be clear, look. Any 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 ladies that are out there. I almost did a big Bill Burr ladies there. Um, I'm going to assume you're male, alright? And I have very good reason to assume you're male. Because my demographics is like 92% male. Alright. We're like 70% over 22. And we're male. Alright. Let's <laughs> be very clear. Alright. Who are you kidding? This is not a... a the, the style and substance here <laughs> is not particularly uh, feminine oriented. I'll, I'll put it that way. You are a true snowflake. But I'm going to assume you're a boy. He's got a pair of balls. I'm going to assume that. That seems unfair, 4v1. Sure, you're fine. Vaganti says, I'm a beautiful, magical girl. I mean, I, I, I'll acknowledge there might have been some changes since I last heard your voice. Story instance that forced co-op is why it got hate. 
do you say that as a as, as someone you don't you don't say that as someone who identifies with that that issue do you roaming name if you are substantiate that what, what do you mean to teach me your point of view on that one i don't get that The experience of playing Guild Wars 2 co-op is so, like, loose that I feel like, you know, it's almost arbitrary whether, whether that's a player or an NPC that's walking alongside you, do you know what I mean? Also, it's an MMO. On, on some level, surely you're buying into the desire to interact socially. I don't know. I, I don't like this thing where you've got this massive fucking game with a ton of different things going on and loads of areas to play solo and then they dare in one patch to add a bit of co-op and it and, and you dare like criticize that it's like fucking hell outside context please all right they can play around with one patch you know what i mean the entire ice cream saga could be forced co-op for all i care yeah we had a little bit of a judder there as this cutscene started and it freaked me out i thought that we were um we were crashing. Uh, the entire Ice Boot Saga could be forced co-op and outside context, I still don't think it would be a great crime. Anyway. It's for the preservation of the Char. It'll be the end of the Char. No reasoning with a Gladium who betrays her own kind. She can't be saved. Make it quick. Is that the smartest move? She's a hero to a lot of char. Another son you've lost. Oh, snap! <laughs> God, look at Scar. He's so cool. He could impregnate me. You're more like your sire than I thought. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. You hated this death. Why would you hate that death? Well, okay, I get it, because Amor is a cool character and it felt very abrupt and blah, blah, blah. I think almost all character deaths in this franchise are going to feel abrupt to a certain degree. Um, yeah, sorry. I don't know if the audio is the audio is I'm too quiet or whatever. Let me turn up my voice a bit more. Has it been like that consistently or just since the reset? Some must fight so that all may be free. What a great line as well! What a great line! Oh, don't be mean to that guy for saying air like that. Loads of people make that mistake. You know, if you hear it in conversation more than you see it written down, you might think she's pronounced air. Oh, it was phone auto, correct? Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> I'm glad I managed to weird you all out so well in the cutscene. <laughs> all right, guys, uh, that's going to be it, I'm afraid. Uh, thank you very much for the attempted chair fund. Uh... I, I, I'm blown away. I don't know what the fuck, man. I don't know. This is crazy. This is silly money. Thank you very much. Um, uh, I will be leaving that bar on there tomorrow as well, like I say, because today's End of Dragons has it in the commentary. So, again, I think it, it's only fair. And uh, and after that, yeah, I think we'll, uh, we'll be able to continue along. So, thanks very much. That was nice and easy. We got the bit of story there. Heating up the delves done. I don't know what to do tomorrow. I don't think I really want to do the footsteps things. Duty calls. Perhaps we can do some of the Drizzlewood story stuff. Like, for example, I never played through this patch with voice acting yet. Right? Easy 5 AP, get us into the story a little bit more again. Might be a good idea. Uh, and then there is actually an achievement I still need in the story as well. Fast Pursuit. End the pursuit within the time limit. And with that, I will actually get the mastery as... Oh, no, 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 22. Oh, yeah, I've got to do the Tengu shit as well. Morale breaker. Oh, God. Wait, they make you do morale breaker for this. 
Oh no, I, I got play dead then. Shouldn't I have played dead? I'm a tier four. Oh no, no, tier four is the next one. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so I do one more and I essentially have the meta done, but we can go a bit further and get morale breaker as well. Some Cold War grind. Basically, once the Lunar New Year's over, I'll replace that grind with Cold War grind again. I'm pretty close. It's 50 for the max, and I've already got 37, so. Um, Mitani Distani says, I want to thank WP Philip giving me the money. Thank you very much. Honestly, guys, you're very, very generous. That's it, though. Thank you. Um, and I'll see you tomorrow for another one. Don't forget to check out Discord. Twitter, all those usual links. And have a good good, uh, good night to the uh, NA people who are up way too late. And have a nice day to the EU people who are starting the days. Ta-ta.